finally so finally the android 14 has been launched for the pixel devices and the rest of the companies will bring this later this year currently i have the google pixel 6a so let's see what's new in this major software update before going into the video don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel Android introduces a new lock screen picker that allows users to choose from a variety of different lock screen styles. This includes things like new clock designs, shortcuts. You can also add your wallpaper with parallax effect. This gives 3D effect to the home screen wallpaper when you unlock it. And you can able to add two shortcuts whatever you want on the lock screen. Android has brought a somewhat useful but most likely useless feature called predict to back gesture. Currently it is working on the settings page only. It shows you a preview of your page you will be taken to when you swipe back. And the new bubble icon with subtle animation is added when you swipe from the edge. So at last the drag and drop content feature is available for Android also. Now able to drag and drop content like photos, hyperlinks, copy text and more. This is gonna be a good move we will. They added a new UI pick for battery, popped up when you plugged in your phone. Coming to the accessibility, the new flash notification is now available in Android 14. You can use either your flashlight or flash the screen when notification received. Android 14 had increased some security features. You can now able to enter directly into the home screen after entering pin without tapping enter. And they added your new symbols which replaces numbers of the pin that you entered. And Android 14 lets you restrict the photos that apps can even access they aren't using the new photo picker. If you tap selected photos and videos, the app can get access to the only selected photos and the rest remaining safe. The UI of the camera is changed. In this version, they gave you separate folders for photo mode and video mode. All the photos are in one place and all the videos are in one place. Good move Google. That's it for today guys. If you found anything useful, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel.